Evelyn, thanks so much for tuning in to my channel today. I do appreciate it. I know it's been a couple of weeks since the last time I posted a video with good reasons. I have been super busy making lots of products and packaging up orders and getting them shipped out to my customers. Today's video is all about infusing my extra strength nettle hair growth oil. I have been infusing my nettle oil in crock pots for over two and a half years. So I'm going to share with you my new pan that I have purchased to infuse my hair growth oils. Okay, this is my new pan. This is the box and it is by Van Marie and I'll list it down in the description below. So now I am going to open it. Okay, this is the on switch and when I turn it and the knob here controls the temperature it goes all the way up to number five I believe is the highest temperature the next step I am going to fill it with distilled water I will not fill it with tap water from the faucet because of the salt and minerals and everything else that's in tap water and I do not want any buildup of salt um, and minerals corroding my um, heat container. So I'm going to fill it up with some distilled water. Okay, it does have um, a max water line, but because of because I am infusing oils, I am definitely going to fill it beyond the water level. Okay, my tank is all heated up. It didn't take very long for it to heat up at all. Here are my jars of my herb infused oils. I am going to place each of my jars inside the tank. video sharing with you how I infuse my extra strength nettle hair growth oil and my pure nettle as well as my hairline growth syrup. In my next video I will share with you straining of my oil and how I how I capture all of as much oil as possible from my herbs. So if you enjoyed this video please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in another video. Bye bye.